Made with all natural ingredients without any preservatives or additives. Cooks with family recipes, big dreams, and now an opportunity to start a business. Good evening, Aunt Flores Cobbler, Miss Cora's Cornbread, and Christina's All Natural Cookies. Just a few of the family recipes at a West End Food Festival today. And yeah, these are the chefs with dreams of having a restaurant, catering business, maybe even a food, food truck. For some, dreams have come true with the help of Mortar, an organization that teaches entrepreneurs how to start a business and then sustain it. Local Tall's Deborah Dixon tasted what the students and the alumni are cooking. We have oatmeal raisin, we have oatmeal raisin with walnuts. Chicken wings, beef kebabs, grits it. Ooh, barbecue, Chicken. oh my. It's just Aunt Flora, Aunt Flora. Just Aunt Flora. <laughs> and Aunt Flora's cobbler pies. Here. All part of Morsels of Mortar Food Festival in the West End. Mortar gives entrepreneurship classes. Everyone here has taken them. Even Aunt Flora, who has cooked with Martha Stewart. My aunt, Flora, was one of the women that portrayed Aunt Jemima from the pancake box. And her recipes were given to my grandmother when she passed away. My grandmother gave them to my mom, and my mom gave them to me. Aunt Flora says Mortar helped her see her business in a new way, an online, we deliver kind of way. I've had the peach cobbler. Today, I'm going for the vegetable one. You're going for the vegetable today. Collard greens, cabbage, yes. broccoli, cauliflower, all the good stuff for the healthy, healthy body. I ate the City Chicks barbecue sauce with the sausage. She said it's all natural with no preservatives, and it's really good. This is stuffing and rib tips from Miss Coors at the booth next door. I learned everything that I know from my grandma. Miss Coors, Southern style catering dishes. We have turkey and dressing are her grandmother's recipes. We have cornbread muffins and we also have string beans and potatoes. So Mortar was established to give people an opportunity who don't typically get opportunities to help them grow their businesses. You have Davis Cookie Collection who's doing organic cookies. Like I can eat a whole cookie and not feel like, you know, oh man, now I gotta go get on the treadmill while I eat the cookie. Oatmeal Is this oatmeal right? Right? Uh -huh. Christina Davis's cookies are in three restaurants like so far. What should I take back to the newsroom? Um, chocolate chip is a winner. No, 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 and no, no, no. oatmeal raisin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it tastes so fresh. Yep, it's made fresh daily. Back at Miss Cora's Catering, owner Latasha Hope is a new graduate of Mortar. For her, a restaurant would be about giving back to the people of the West End where she grew up and where her little sister was killed by a stray bullet. And I would also like to encourage them, if they have dreams, they can do it. All they have to do is keep their mind to it and keep pushing forward. No matter what happens, you can do what you want to do. Thank you so much. Yummy. Deborah Dixon, Local 12 News. Hungry yet? Yeah? Um, I'm really hungry. You can apply for classes on everything from making community connections to financial workshops and the art of starting a business by going to wearemortar.com.